Welcome to this course on transition metal organometallics in catalysis and biology. We have been talking about olefin polymerization in the last few lectures and in this uh, regard in the uh, immediate uh, past few lectures we have focused on uh, uh, the development of uh, ziegler natta catalyst particularly with respect to uh, uh, polyethylene uh, uh, as well as uh, uh, polypropylene. In this regard uh, let me just uh, uh, briefly uh, talk about uh, 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 the uh, highlights of what we have uh, covered so far. In this context, the first uh, we spoken about is ethylene TiCl4 25 degree centigrade 1 bar pressure. This is Ziegler Natta catalyst. gives a polyethylene and this uh, is under heterogeneous conditions. Produces HDPE of uh, molar masses 10 to the power 4 to 10 to the power 5 Dalton. Subsequently, uh, we saw that for polypropylene it gave isotactic polypropylene or IPP and uh, head to uh, this is also heterogeneous and this also has head to tail linkages. The first in this uh, advance focusing more on polypropylene the first uh, catalyst for polypropylene was CP2 titanium dichloride with ET2 Al Cl, this is the, uh, the, this is for polyethylene, sorry. ethylene this catalyst is homogeneous uh, 
uh, homogeneous, but uh, lower activity for ethylene and no activity for alpha olefin. So, uh, the and this was reported by uh, uh, Nata. So, the first homogeneous uh, the first homogeneous catalyst uh, first homogeneous catalyst was reported by Nata. Uh, uh, then subsequently Kaminsky uh, produced CP2 zirconium Me2 MaO. So, for polyethylene homogeneous and extremely active 500 kg of PE polyethylene per millimole of zirconium of zirconium per hour. So, post this what was uh, reported is the fifth one which is CP2 zirconium PH2 CP2 titanium PH2 MAO and this ethylene EN T H I M D zirconium C L two M A O M A O this uh, we had discussed uh, 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 that uh, uh, is again homogeneous and was producing 43,000 kilogram of polypropylene per mole of zirconium per hour. So, uh, 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 what we uh, the point uh, to note is that uh, this is sort of a timeline of uh, uh, development. Uh, so, uh, the first uh, is heterogeneous for polyethylene, uh, uh, the then heterogeneous for polyethylene uh, and then uh, first uh, homogeneous uh, came uh, with uh, this BCP system, homogeneous for polyethylene. Now, this BCP system with MAO uh, gave extremely high activity of polyethylene per millimole per hour and then subsequently BCP system with MAO and this ANSA system with MAO uh, gave extremely high isotactic polyethylene per hour. And 
uh, we had uh, 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 have looked at this system, uh, uh, this answer system in uh, much more detail in our previous uh, 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 discussion. So, uh, and uh, uh, what we saw uh, that uh, as we move from homogeneous to heterogeneous, uh, uh, in these cases the catalysis are as we move from homogeneous to heterogeneous, this is multi site uh, uh, for this heterogeneous and heterogeneous and for the homogeneous ones these are all homogeneous, uh, these are uh, single site catalysis and uh, this single site catalysis means that polymer uh, has narrow polydispersity index and low PDI and polymers uh, are much more well behaved in terms of uh, their properties. So, let us now focus on this uh, uh, answer complex that we had discussed uh, which has extremely good uh, activity for polypropylene. Hmm. So, this uh, answer complex E n T H I N D zirconium C L 2 M A O. Structure wise the complex looks something like as it is shown over here. Maybe the, stru uh, the structure as is shown over here, this is bound to zirconium with M A O. So, this is the structure of this complex and uh, the ratio of uh, these to M A O is about MAO uh, uh, can be uh, represented as AL O methyl. So, this ratio is 1 is to 300 means large excess, large excess of MAO is required hmm. and uh, then uh, the question comes uh, that what is the role of MAO? The question subsequently come is what is the role of MAO? It seems like that MAO is a magical reagent uh, which uh, enhances uh, the activity of this catalyst, this homogeneous catalyst to the extent that it even surpasses the original heterogeneous uh, uh, ziegler natta uh, catalyst. The answer to that is that MAO has three functions. MAO has three functions uh, uh, that MAO acts as a methylating agent uh, that MAO acts as a methylating agent that means that these halides uh, get replaced uh, to becoming methyl. So, they convert zirconium halides to zirconium methyls 
and second uh, function is that uh, it has a Lewis acid carbon ionic acceptor. Lewis acidic acceptor. This is an important function of MAO. Uh, the first is it is methylating it and then making it uh, dimethyl and still uh, there are large excess of MAO which uh, uh, are uh, highly electron deficient Lewis acidic species. Now, after they have methylated the halide, they abstract one of the methyl. So, it is not only a methylating agent, but also it is a methyl anion uh, acceptor. So, that is why it is called this a carbon ion acceptor. So, not only it is making uh, methylating it, uh, converting halide to methyl, and then subsequently it is also accepting uh, abstracting the methyl snatching the methyl and the third role of mao is that uh, uh, and serve as a counter anion to uh, zirconosine cation So, it has a uh, three role huh, and this uh, uh, can be uh, uh, suitably uh, explained in this series of uh, chemical equation as is uh, shown below. For example, C P 2 zirconium chloride. methyl MAO so methyl so this is uh, the first function that uh, we had seen the methylating methylating agent huh. now the second function is that it acts as a methyl abstraction. So, this can be represented as methyl with MAO giving C P 2 zirconium one of the uh, methyl gets abstracted the other is a vacant site plus so only one, uh, one methyl gets accept, abstracted and then ends up becoming a vacant site over here and then the anion so this is the second role uh, uh, this is the, uh, the what portrayed out here is the second role of methyl abstraction and then the this methyl group ends up in the carbon ion of MAO as is shown here. Al MeO N L M E M E O. So uh, this uh, methyl group uh, which gets abstracted uh, uh, from here ends up on the aluminum as is shown here and uh, then uh, the both the second and then subsequently this acts as a counter ion to this zirconosium cation and uh, 
uh, what happens subsequently is in this vacant site the polypropylene uh, lands up occupies polypropylene comes and CP2 zirconium methyl this cation and Me MAO minus anion which undergoes insertion uh, uh, with subsequently with many propylene as it is shown to give isotactic polypropylene. So, uh, the role of uh, MAO is uh, uh, gr uh, greatly uh, explained that it has three first is it works as a methylating agent. So, this gets converted to methyl second it has a anion abstractor. So, one methyl uh, gets converted uh, gets abstracted and then there is a vacant site hole and then subsequently to this hole uh, the olefin comes binds and uh, so this now serves as a, uh, a non coordinating anion. Uh, uh, non coordinating anion, non coordinating anion uh, with low charge density. So, this is a interesting observation uh, that uh, uh, this uh, MAO has uh, uh, several roles and uh, the after abstraction uh, what is possible is that uh, you know uh, 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 it stabilizes the zirconium uh, two species cation, uh, uh, zirconium cation uh, being uh, a non coordinating anion with low charge density. Now, uh, what uh, it uh, 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 sort of implies that uh, this can be achieved with any other uh, non coordinating uh, anion uh, uh, with low uh, charge density and uh, that should also be equally uh, effective. And uh, the ingenuity uh, of organometallic uh, 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 chemist comes into play where indeed uh, uh, such a well uh, uh, behaved cat uh, catalyst were developed. Uh, uh, with uh, other non coordinating anion and which were extremely good for uh, pol uh, polymerization. So, this shows how uh, the structure activity relationship, how understanding helps in uh, developing uh, uh, the catalyst or helps in improving the catalyst. And uh, this uh, is done by Tobin Marx, professor of North uh, uh, West, uh, Eastern University, who had uh, used. Uh, a non coordinating anion uh, to develop uh, this zirconium species which is extremely uh, active. So, what Marx did is uh, he, he took this uh, uh, CP2 zirconium dimethyl and uh, used this uh, Lewis acid uh, of boron. So, now instead of aluminum it is boron uh, C6 F5 O3 uh, in pentane. Uh, gave uh, 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 CP2 uh, uh, zirconium uh, methyl uh, uh, the loosely interacting with uh, CH3 uh, B C6 F5 whole 3. Uh, so, uh, uh, this is a, a ion pair separated uh, species with uh, zirconium uh, being in positive and this uh, boron uh, being negative after abstracting uh, this uh, uh, methyl from uh, zirconium methyl. Uh, 
uh, zirconium uh, methyl and this was contribution uh, this famous uh, nice example uh, was reported by Marx in um, uh, 1991 and uh, this complex this cation tech complex Uh, resembled the MAO analogs uh, in, uh, in catalytic in catalytic performance and uh, uh, this uh, the uh, this was uh, structurally the catalyst List was structurally characterized and uh, uh, is rightfully designated as a single site catalyst. So, uh, this was a fantastic uh, improvisation uh, made by Mark where uh, uh, he uh, development or replacement of MAO using uh, this uh, boron uh, uh, trifluorophenyl uh, uh, reagent uh, which abstracted uh, one of the methyl and also uh, behaved as a non-coordinating uh, anion in stabilizing this zirconium uh, um, CP uh, methyl cation. Uh, which uh, carried out the uh, uh, polymerization of polypropylene uh, with equal efficiency as that of the MAO uh, counterpart. So, uh, that uh, this shows uh, uh, how uh, uh, understanding a suitable a proper understanding uh, of the uh, catalyst mechanism helps in improving the catalyst uh, uh, greatly and that is why uh, the structure activity uh, relationship is so important. Uh, in developing uh, the efficiency of the catalyst. So, with this uh, I come to the conclusion of today's lecture uh, where we have seen how uh, this catalyst for polypropylene uh, improved from the heterogeneous uh, 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 Ziegler Nata titanium tetrachloride diethyl aluminum uh, chloride based catalyst uh, multi site catalyst to the focus shifted uh, towards developing single site catalyst uh, that uh, were advantageous. But the inherent difficulty of uh, this uh, homogeneous single site catalyst was their activity was inherently low which was however overcome by advent of MAO by Kaminsky in 1981 and subsequently uh, even uh, uh, MAO got replaced by contribution from Mark uh, uh, who could uh, develop uh, uh, better uh, similar catalyst uh, uh, bearing boron based uh, uh, non coordinating anion. Uh, where uh, the boron trifeno uh, 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 pentaphenyl uh, 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 tri, uh, C6F5 uh, 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 C6F5 moiety could uh, act as serve as a uh, methyl abstraction as well as non coordinating anion and stabilize uh, this uh, 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 single side catalyst. So, with this uh, uh, I come to a conclusion of today's uh, lecture. We are going to be uh, lo uh, looking at this uh, catalyst development and some more uh, uh, interesting aspects about how to achieve uh, the symbiotacticity, isotacticity at will and the uh, uh, rationale that went in developing this catalyst as we discuss the topic in more detail in the next lecture. Till that uh, uh, time, uh, goodbye and th uh, thank you for being with me in this class. See you in the next lecture.